my perfume choice for today thought I could go with Daisy I've had this for like 15 years scent just brings me back to the time it smells so good it's like a floral clean scent and since I'm wearing a white top with mustard yellow pants I thought I would add a blue bow it has little daisies on them Good morning. Welcome back to the vlog. Today is going to be work day in my life. It's actually been a minute since I picked up the camera, but I thought it would be really fun to bring you guys along to work today. I did start my new job about two to three weeks ago, so it's gonna be new vibes. And I think those who's transitioning to new environments would enjoy this video. Let's get the day started. First thing I'm gonna make is a cup of matcha for myself this morning. I'm gonna be bringing it in in this like tumbler. I still consider myself a matcha noob, but my matcha at home actually tastes better than what I've bought outside. So I'm gonna be making it more at home. I usually use like this much. For those who want some sort of structure into the work days, is having some sort of morning routine. I'm still trying to figure that out for myself but I've been incorporating making matches in the morning. I've been doing that as of last week. It's been really nice because it's something for me to look forward to in the morning and I usually have this at work, so it's just a nice tech for me. This is my first time actually having matcha with no milk. Mm. Used to it. I need milk. I think I need more sweetener. I'm gonna add some honey actually. All right, I'm running a little late, so I'm gonna have to head out now. Another thing I like to do in the morning is to listen to a podcast because I have some company in the morning as I get ready, and I always learn new things on podcasts, so I really enjoy that. For real, gotta head out now. See you outside. There's no needle rooms yet. I believe it's still being built. Taking lunch in this like coffee area. I'm actually time blocking lunch at this new job because I'm 
previous words never really took much but I'm trying to be healthier and I'm just trying to hold myself accountable to my own health there's a lot of meetings in this new world so I need to set time aside for breaks I need to find a room so I can talk properly and louder most of my day today reviewing SEO and SEM documents that I received during my onboarding process. SEO I'm familiar with so I didn't really have to teach myself anything. It's more so just familiarizing myself with the work the company has done or the team has done. For SEM I'm a little newer to the space or at least the technical piece of it. So I've just been like educating myself looking for the documents overall just joining in and listening into all the meetings because I think as you kind of listen to the readouts of the business you kind of could pick up things here and there but that's been most of my days able to snag a room. I actually had to call customer service to set up my 401k. But yeah, I'm three weeks into this new job and it's really exciting. I really love the brand and what they stand for. For my first two weeks here, I was actually struggling to try to grasp everything. I think I just put a lot of pressure on myself to learn everything as soon as possible, which is a lot. And I just feel like I'm holding myself to such high expectation. Every time I start a new job, I always feel like I have something to prove, which is not necessarily a good thing. I should only prove to myself to want to succeed in this role, not to prove it to others. So this is definitely something I'm trying to work on. Really just give myself some grace because I'm doing great. I'm doing the best I can. I also haven't really been doing anything outside of work because I've been trying to train my mind to get used to this new work life. I don't think I've ever mentioned, but I used to work for an agency. However, I have now moved into the brand side. So it was really interesting to see how the business work on the other side of things. I'm going to be continue doing SEO and SEM as well. This is something that's kind of new to me. So some things are familiar, some things are new, but I'm also really excited to learn something new and challenge myself. It's currently 5 p.m. I might just wrap up my notes and my head out soon. I usually like to wrap my notes up in the back half of the day, just so I'm well prepared and adjusted for the next day. I think I'm gonna head back to my desk and wrap up soon so I can head home. Finally leaving the office. didn't vlog at the grocery store but I did stop by got some milk because we ran out this morning I made a matcha with no milk and it didn't hit the same so got a refill milk got some cotton candy grapes got some strawberries because I'm making something yummy later hint I'm also super hungry so gonna eat Miss me? Did you shower yet? Uh, no. Really? I think you did. Mm -hmm. Dinner is served. We have some rice, air fried salmon that Angelo made earlier. I just reheated it and I fried an egg because I'm starving and I added the hot chili oil. Mm. All 
done. And I sat on the seat for another 30 minutes watching TikToks. And I have to go back to work tomorrow. It's great and all, but I can't do the office three days a week. I forgot if I mentioned that, but I have to go to the office three days a week. Before I shower, I thought I would just had dry the strawberries and just fix the chocolate covered strawberries. Great. <gasps> Chocolate's all melted. I microwave it in 15 second intervals, about four times, so like a minute ish. Dang. I spilled the chocolate all over. I kind of rushed it, so the presentation is like a 6 out of 10, but the taste is going to be there. Can't wait. I have some leftover melted chocolate that can't go to waste, so I'm just going to eat it now. I actually prefer this over the chocolate completely hardened. This is quite nasty. You're never going to catch me doing this outside. Shower time, finally. and watch it with me. Oh shit! Yo! Yeah. Oh, sour. Oh, sour.